Say no to data extraction tools. Make just drop the long awaited feature which is not even in N810 and no more extra subscriptions. We used to rely on third party services for extracting stuff in make.com. Well, not anymore. From invoices and resume to voice clips and image descriptions and tags, you can now process everything and send it straight into your AI workflows. No more copy paste, just drag, drop and automate. Introducing the Make AI Content Extractor and it's a beast. You can now extract text from PDF and images, describe images and create tags, detect objects with exact location, transcribe or translate audio files. This is a quick workflow I developed to demonstrate Make AI Content Extractor. So in order to uh, find the module, you can click on add and type Make AI Content Extractor. So just you can see here. Cool. So you can find here make AI content extractor and here there are tons of features. See on document we have extract information from document, invoice and receipt and for image we have generate caption for image, uh, describe an image, get image tags, detect objects in, a, in an image. On speech we have transcribe an audio file or translate an audio file cool right so let's go quickly to the demonstration of these modules so what i did i have taken uh, one image file and resume file as well so let's uh, quickly see the image file how it looks so this is the image file uh, i just dropped in dropbox and you can see uh, a beautiful picture and we have one more file uh, here you can see the resume file so we have resume uh, let me open the resume. So this is the resume. So we have a project details, technical skills, summary, achievements, education system. So everything is having data. So we have an image and then we have a PDF with test within it, right? So now let's go to the scenario. So we have the scenario with these two. Uh, I just put an uh, set multiple variable module with image file URL and the resume file URL. So we are all good to go. And then what I did, I just connected the first module extract information from a document. So this module extract information from a document can extract the details from the given input URL. So what I did here, you can see I have mapped the resume file that comes from the first module and you can see this module supports PDF up to 2000 pages and 500 MB in size. And that's really incredible. And we can also give page ranges if you wish to extract limited pages. So here I provided the URL from the set multiple variables. I mean the URL pointing to the resume file. Yeah. So we have mapped it. As I mentioned, the make AI content extractor just extract the details from the resume or from invoices lesson. So we need to pass this to the open AI brain, the AI brain to you know uh, make defined result like what you what specifically you wish to extract. So for that we have given the open AI instruction. So it's loading. So we have selected a model and option with create a chat completion. Then I mentioned that please extract the following details from the attached resume and there is a CV like general information about the person name the candidate name and then their certifications and about their experience right so it will extract this information in JSON structure so I have given a JSON structure as well and all good and then we have given the user under the user control we are given the content uh, extracted from the uh, makes AI content extractor. Cool, right? And then I have another root here. You can see what I'm doing. We have an image file as well. So I've just connected other modules of this content extractor, like, you know, describe an image where it uh, where we are again passing the image file here so the image file i just shown you here right so we are passing here to extract the image detail similarly create captions for an image so this will create uh, up to 10 captions for the image and we can also generate tags from the image so for that we are using get image tags module and then pass the image file url so let's run this and see the magic so i'm running Cool. So it just extracted the content from the make AI content extractor. So you can see the content is here. So all the person name is experience. Everything is extracted. And then finally, we have the uh, uh, open AI analyzing the resume and giving the result. So we get the general information, their LinkedIn URL, then education. So you can see their education over here. So oh yeah, the 
graduation and the certification you can see uh, certification on data structure algorithm so everything is extracted as per the resume you see here so if you go here you can see uh, the education uh, so they took BTEC from Lowly then the school so if you come to the scenario exactly the same education is getting reflected here on the certification as well like if you see we have three certificates and we can see them over certificate section as well cool right so that's the power of makes ai content extractor believe me guys no extra subscription and now let's go and see what it has extracted from the image file so you see this image and now ai is able to interpret it without open ai so no more extra credits no more extra subscription so make is telling that the image depicts a scene of a man standing alongside uh, his dog on a grassy area beside a road the man is dressed in a white tank top khaki pants and brown boots with a watch on his left wrist and a bracelet on his right wrist see this cool it's giving entire information in detailed way see what are the watch bracelet everything is extracted and given and similarly it's generating the captions for the image so you can see uh, a man walking uh, a man walking a dog on a leash a dog with a leash a person's leg and legs in a field so it's giving uh, you know the area the bounding box areas i mean the xyz a location of these objects and the confidence probability and the test i mean the caption similarly we have get image tags module which gives tag to this image like outdoor grass tree sky dog breed person right pet foodwear etc cool right now let's go to an actual use case this is a workflow created within our company to evaluate candidate resume and extract the information so the hr doesn't have to go through each work experience or its uh, education within the resume separately right so what we did we have a monday board created so you can use google sheet or any crm and we have a form connected with this monday board and you can see the form which we created in monday using monday.com you can also use apps like jot form type form or even microsoft form so i created a form collecting name email resume and profile pic so we share this to candidates and when they submit this form it will create an item in monday board and you know in the scenario we are watching the new form submission or the new items that comes in monday board and that's cool so we have the trigger here like watch board items so you can see we have watch board items so it will uh, watch the new item created in board and if it's google sheet uh, if you are going to follow google sheet you have something known as watch new rows so in google sheet you have watch new rows so i go with monday.com because our entire crm is built upon monday.com and so i'm going with the watch board item so let's go and run this and see the result right how this is going to happen so basically uh, before submitting let me uh, just show you a couple of things so we are getting whenever an item is created in monday i mean when the form is submitted we get those details here and we get more details by using the module get an item so get an item will get more details and we are passing the pulse id so the pulse id means the item id of that monday board and then we download so we are submitting two things in the uh, I mean the form one is the resume and the profile pic so we are uploading both so what we are doing here we are downloading those files which we get from the get an item module or the item so we download it and then we pass this to the AI content extractor and see guys when the AI content extractor have multiple pages it will input the data in multiple bundles so the earlier the uh, pdf that i shown in the demo was with one page when there are multiple pages we have to be very cautious and we have to connect test aggregator so with test aggregator you know we can combine multiple page contents into a single test and then pass to the same open ai i just shown in the last scenario so the same workflow i used here i mean the same open ai i have used here with same instructions and i have connected it right so i'm passing the test output from the test aggregator and finally we are also adding uh, one notification message to slack that we have a new talent hub signed up uh, with salutation first name last name 
and you know in monday we uh, it's so powerful that we can add work experience education and certification as separate sub items in monday.com because monday is with item and sub items so we are handling this as well uh, by iterating or looping through the work experience education and certification so now let's see quickly how this is uh, like how makes ai content extractor is going to help us in real use case so this is the talent submission form so let me put my name and then the email yeah so support at mscore.pro right and then my resume and finally my old profile pic yeah so i'm just adding that so it's uploaded let's click on submit so it's submitted and let's run this workflow and see the magic so we have the existing data i'm running it so we have the resume downloaded and makes AI content extractor is running across all the pages. So guys, 2000 pages, that's what make is assuring based on the description provided in the module. That's, that's something cool guys. And you're not paying anything extra right now. That's something, uh, something I would say it's a beast. Yeah. So let's see the result before that. Let's go to our board. Yeah. So we have Mohammed Jahar created this item based on the form submission. So that's just the form inputs and it's running. So we got entire test content. So if you see here, as I said, per page, we have the details extracted. So we have page number two, page number three, and everything is extracted and sent to the uh, OpenAI module. And then finally, we have work experience, three experience, two education, three certificates. We send a Slack message. So we have a cool Slack notification. And finally, so it says new talent hub sign up name Mr. Mohammed Jahar. And finally, we are iterating through the work experience. We have three experience, two education, and then three certificate, and everything is created as sub item in Monday.com. So let's go to Monday.com. So cool guys. So we have the talent here, Mohammed Jahar, and three work experience. Yeah, so we have three work experience, two education, BTEC high school and then three certificates and you can see here we have also extracted the start date end date company name where we worked uh, based on the resume and the education uh, college name and who issued the certification so this is something incredible let me show you the resume here is a resume so you can see there are three uh, experience all three are reflected over here you can see it's reflected and we have two education and that is also there let me go and see the education side so you can see two education right one from dubai and one from india and then finally we have three certificates from data camp and altair so we have this certificate as well. So everything is extracted so powerful and so cool by makes AI content extractor. No more juggling third party tools. We used to depend on external tools for this. Now it's built into make just drag, drop and automate all without leaving your scenario. Follow for more updates.